Investigation to a fatal charter bus crash in Richmond County is growing. The NTSB announced today it is sending two investigators to look into exactly what happened Saturday afternoon. Highway Patrol believes a tire blowout could have caused a bus carrying a football team to crash on Highway 77 near Rockingham. Four people were killed. 42 were taken to local hospitals. And CBS North Carolina's Carly Griffith has been digging into the bus itself, who it belonged to, and whether or not those 46 passengers should have been on it. I've been doing this job for 23 years now. Um, I've seen my share, and this is probably one of one of the worst, uh, especially when you have a, a group of students, you know, I call young people that are just starting their lives, um, going to a football game. Law enforcement says the front tire of a charter bus carrying the Rama Juco Academy football team blew out Saturday afternoon, causing it to crash into a median divider. The driver and three passengers were killed. I was half asleep, and when I opened my eyes, we. We had hit the rail, and that's all I remember. The team was driving from Rock Hill, South Carolina, to play the University of God's Chosen in Rayford. According to Highway Patrol, the charter bus is registered to Sandy River Baptist Church in Chester, South Carolina. The church referred us to their insurance agent at Southern Mutual Church Insurance, who told us they have no comment due to the active investigation. According to the Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration, the privately owned charter bus is subject to federal safety regulations, such as an annual inspection and documentation of such inspections. Those records are kept on a state level. We did not immediately hear back from South Carolina State Police, but federal records show no inspections of that charter bus within the past 24 months. Officials say the investigation into the crash could last up to several months. For CBS North Carolina, I'm Carly Griffith.